Are you looking for an airbrush that puts out a wide spray pattern but doesn't consume a whole lot of air? Well, we've got the airbrushes for you. It's the Grex Tritium 0.7 millimeter with the fan cap. Check out our in-house painter, Dylan, as he, uh, as he uses it for the first time. What's up, Dylan? What you got going on here? What's going on, Chad? I'm just doing this little piece for Createx. About to uh, take off these stickers so I can do another coat of candy. I made myself a candy base coat using this uh, 4050. You know the one that we're testing? Mm-hmm. Now, you know, of course, you know it's not released yet, but I made a uh, base coat candy, so I put a whole bunch of different things in there, the Cosmic, the Sparkle, made a base coat candy, and it's laying quite well. All right, well, I got something uh, for you to try out. It's pretty uh, It's pretty sweet. It's a .7 uh, airbrush fan cap pattern on there. And uh, what do you think, what kind of spray pattern do you think you're going to get from this as far as width goes? Uh, you said it's a... Point seven. It's point seven, right? Doesn't Honestly. look very big. No, I would assume possibly like a two and a half, three inch fan. Two and a half, three inch. All right. Well, how about you load this up with some of that base candy and uh, give it a little test? All right. I'll spray these edges really quick. Let's see what we got going on here. Why don't you give it a little test on this? And the cool thing about the side feed is that, you know, if you're spraying downward, you can turn the cup up. If you're spraying upward, really? you can obviously rotate the cup. Um, so it's really good for working in all sorts of different positions. Yeah, I mean, dude, this is a huge fan. <laughs> I would not expect this from this. You, you said just turn it? Yeah, you can just uh, just rotate the cup if you want to spray more straight down. No way. I mean, there's, no, there's no spitting, there's no air bubble stuck in there. I mean, it does it turn all 360? Well, you don't want to turn it upside down just because of the, uh, but yeah, you know, be, you could. Yeah, this you is, technically could. <laughs> this is nice. Yeah, it's a really surprisingly wide spray pattern, actually, for a fan cap. Yeah, especially for a It doesn't seven. look like it would be very big, and no. uh, but it really does put the paint out. And it sprays that base candy real nice. It's it great sex product. I could definitely, uh, I definitely see myself using this, especially the trigger. Oh man, this is comfortable. <laughs> this is nice. That's I like this. The first this. time you held it, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> first time I sprayed it. Oh man, I need to make another panel now. <laughs> One single. All right. Mm. All right. Uh, shoot. I don't even know if I have my little tape measure in here. Okay. So while we were grabbing a tape measure, uh, we went ahead and switched to the round cap that is included. Um, so now we're going to give that a little test as well. And it looks like that Dude, that's fan five, pattern. Five inches. Close to five inches uh, with the 0.7 nozzle on there. Oh, that's beautiful. Really hard to beat that. And it's really low air consumption, which just helps you use any type of compressor versus something you know larger like a shock compressor. Yeah. Twice what Dylan was expecting, right? Yeah, yeah. Two, Two times. times what yeah. I was expecting. Well, shoot. Let's let's get a fresh piece of paper and see how this round tip goes. Fine lines. I mean, this is this is a fool. I like this. Right, let me turn the air down. Oh, and that's G Mac right there, which is another Grex product. So. If you don't have the airbrush with the uh, Mac valve on there, you can just throw a G Mac on, tune down the air a bit, and get some detail work going. All with the single airbrush here. For a little tip, man, that's that's really impressive. I could definitely use this for shadowing on edges and such. Because I honestly get some great detail. Of course not with the base coat candy, it's a little chunky. Yeah, base coat candy not exactly ideal for, you know, super detailed spraying, oh, but man. it's still pushing it through there with no problem, and, you know, some pretty nice lines. So, so, I am extremely impressed with this. Well, this one's mine now, so yeah. <laughs> you guys may have to restock. Alright, so what did you think overall, uh, spray pattern wise, round cap, fan cap? Spray pattern, great on both caps. Round cap, definitely for more detail, for more intricate work. Uh, bigger cap for full coverage. I mean, for a panel like this, I could use it for sure on cars when I do my patterns and such. It's got a great feel. Love the trigger. The grip, 
I mean, you really can't beat the grip. It's fantastic. You really can't. Yeah. The fact that this articulates any direction, man, <laughs> this is this is going to change the game because how many times do you have to work on a roof and you got to get really in there? Sometimes you lose your airflow. Now you won't. Now it's going to be continuous all the way around. Exactly. So it's the Grex Tritium with the .7 fan cap or round cap. We have it available at SprayGunner.com. Um, we have received word that Grex will make these sets officially available in the second half of this year, 2020. And uh, but come get it, Spray Gunner now. We've got it. Beautiful thing. Is this your design on the shirt? Yeah, did this when I was uh, 16. Oh, cool. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Nice. Yeah, this, this right here. I like this. 